In the wake of September 11, Australia went on a frenzy of lawmaking. Our federal parliament enacted 54 new statutes. These statutes have a big effect on our liberties, our way of life and our democracy. Of particular concern are the powers that have been given to ASIO, our secret intelligence organisation. Here are five things you should know about how you might be affected by Australia's new anti-terror laws. You can be detained without charge or trial for up to 14 days. You can be the subject of covert surveillance, even if you're not suspected of having committed a crime or even attempting to do so. Your home and personal property can be searched by police who don't even need a warrant. ASIO can have any Australian citizen brought in for questioning. They can even be strip searched and people can be asked questions about family members and others. Once in custody, a person could be denied the right to speak to their family, their friends, their employer, or even a medical professional. This can happen even where you're not suspected of having committed a crime. If you refuse to give ASIO the information or records it requests, you can find yourself in jail for up to five years. These sorts of exceptional powers are normally only reserved for wartime, but they're now part of our law. These laws have been passed in the name of the War on Terror, but that's a conflict with no end in sight. Unfortunately, our federal politicians have moved on to other matters, and it means that these laws remain on the statute book unamended and unchanged.